white governments supporting these black organizations that are going and kidnapping these people and help hide these women. Don't be no fool, people. I just ain't that stupid. Anytime you see that violence being perpetrated in Africa when it's black on black, it's because white government perpetrated. Just like the Hutus and the Tutsi, the white government, the Belgian, the French perpetrated that mess. They've gone in and assassinated these people and put it on other people, and blacks wind up killing and massacring one another. Don't y'all be stupid. You think this game violence on the street ain't perpetrated by your Secret Service CIA? Yeah. I'll tell you guys last night. Let me ask you, what is the purpose of all? Let me see how many intelligent agents we got. Y'all count out. Homeland Security. CIA. Secret Service. National Security. FBI. DEA. ATF. Then you got the local police. Then you got the sheriff department. Then you got the local government um, federal agency. And he pick, hold on. Then you still got customs. You still got TSA. How many agencies do these people need? All they doing is creating agency off of us and nothing's getting done. I was thinking about this morning how ignorant our people are. You have CIA officers that sat here in the 90s. These white boys were coming in, putting looses on their desk. Don't nobody remember that now, do they? These black boys coming to work, white boys got nooses laying on their desk telling them to hang them. I got a gun. All I need to do is take this rope and fingerprint it. One of y'all white boys going to be swimming. You ain't finna threaten my life with no news. You got a gun and know what I know. We ain't gonna play like that. Certain stuff you don't play with nobody with. I know what you can do. We ain't gonna play like this. Nobody ever prosecuted the Secret Service agent that they found out in the woods, made a video. Y'all don't remember that? With them and the Klan in the woods. Guess what they had on all the trees? No niggas allowed. Video, pictures of all these people. Hundreds of them. None of them ever prosecuted. The blacks, they, they were told to open their mouth. They would come up dead. Still kept their jobs. Folks, we ain't gonna never be free in America. Quit being stupid and so passive. What, let me see. If I keep talking like this, let me get what they're gonna do. They're gonna kill me. If I drive my car and the police stop me, they're gonna kill me. So not saying that hadn't helped us, has it? That's why they can keep doing what they're doing. Let me tell y'all something. I watched this black guy on Gangland. It was beautiful, too. The project's up in Tennessee, LA, LMA uh, Mafia. I forgot the Lorraine. What's the name of the project? Who? What's the name of it again? Lemoyne Owen Gardens. Beautiful. Took them jokers. Listen, black officer took them. You know they walked with their bandana. That's their flag. He took it, snatched it. He's what you're doing to the guy. said, you know, just, he said, took it, wiped his shoe with it. He said, this is your flag. I take it and wipe my shoe with it. I said, why that nigga don't do that with the United States flag? Ain't no red bandana never put me in no slavery. I ain't never been segregated against by no blue bandana. He, why he, he ain't mad enough to take that red and white and blue one and do it with it? Let me see how hard it is to catch the hell's angels. I wish that we had some kind of agency that could follow and track a bunch of white boys with leather jacket with mongols rolled on the back of it and hell's angels in some kind of way we could track them because they ride on these things in the sky. They're incognito motorcycles. With chains and guns and flags on them. I wish it was some kind of way we had some agencies to catch them. You never see them slap them around. You ain't got no investigation. You won't ever find them filing no charge about no police whipping up on them. But it's all of a sudden they can go to the project and snatch these black boys up and they easy to find. I never, let me see, they got a gang say, a club. Get what's on the mongrels. I wonder how we could find them. Hell's angel wrote on your jacket, and y'all got a biker week. Y'all had bikers. I can't get this. How hard is it to catch these white boys? How many times had a, had a Ku Klux Klan fire charge because they've been beat and falsely arrested and shot by the police? How hard is it to catch a nigga with a snow cone hat on and a bed sheet? No draws and some cowboy boots. How hard is it? Black people, we in bad shape. No, and there's black people in these jobs with position, with poor that can do something. Too done stupid. 
too done stupid. We can't let out need people. People walk around, listen, rape women, videotape. They had FBI agents, they went in to infiltrate them. Do you know they had to pull them out? Guess why? They got in too deep. Got in there and fell in love with the game. They were beating people up just like they were doing. They had to snatch them out of there and fake their death to get them back. Don't happen with us, don't do that. We in bad shape. Nobody respects us. Nobody respects us because you know why we don't respect ourselves. We don't ask the right questions. Everything they put up or they give us a little dangling part of circle make a fool out of us. Don't trust none of these people. They put anybody black they put in your face talking. Watch them. Anybody, nobody got no pull from them. Anything you get, get authorized from a white man. I don't trust none of them. Give, anybody give me, don't tell me you're your own person. Shut your mouth. They pay your check. How you going to be your own person? Nobody white going to pay me and let me say what I want to say. They'll never, they're going to let Tony Smith say what he wants to say and they're going to pay me. I'm waiting on them checks. You ask the thing, they finna give you one of these black people and they finna get in your face and they finna tell you flat like that and be transparent. Sure they are. Sure they are. We have to stand up and address our own issue as a nation, as a people. We don't need nobody going, even the group I'm talking to, I ain't told them, we don't need, we not, I ain't going to talk to nobody and tell nobody nothing that people ain't said. Either the people agree on it or we don't do it. You got more, let me, tell, let me be honest with you, they know who to grab and who to be. They're not going to grab nobody black with no name and no notoriety that they can pull no press. They're going to get these people that don't know their rights, these people in these lower income brackets and neighborhood in these projects. The people of us that claim we done escaped and got better paying jobs and got these degrees, we forgot about them. Now we got to go back and rescue them. It's our fault. The only reason they do it because who's going to say so? Who cares about a nigga in the projects? Who cares about a project hole? Who cares? The worst part is we don't. Why you think they do it? Why are people right? You don't even care. Why should I care? So I just told y'all that for whatever reason it is. But it's right. Stop letting these people make a fool out of y'all. Don't believe nothing these people say. Ain't nobody perfect. Ain't gonna never be they perfect. Ain't gonna work. I keep my butt too tight. Ain't nobody hand getting in them. Y'all hear me? I'm through. I'm through. I'm done. Nobody gonna never control me. They can forget it. Whatever, they, whatever bullet they got, whatever poison pill they got, go ahead and drop it in the drink and go ahead and start shooting. I ain't like King. I'm going to be looking. I'm not a, I'm going to be doing it now. I'm here, though. <laughs> I ain't finna walk out like I'm stupid. You know when them niggas say, hey, walk out that door right quick and get something. <laughs> that right. <laughs> Soon as you walk out, I'm saying, that's Tony Smith just walked out. Pow, pow, pow. I said, man, they out there for real. You like Saddam Hussein, I got to give him a couple of body doubles. But you know what? You get these people that power. These people don't have the power they got. You had to get them that power. Let these folk come in the news media and all of them. Just know already they're going to try to wreck everybody. That's how they going to do I told you, preacher. I said they're going to try to divide us. Anytime you get up and you try to do something right, they're going to try to divide and tell them about what I said. Anything I said, I said it twice. Y'all hear me? I heard you say something about somebody's mama. I talk about your mama. Say they're going to eat it too. They ain't that right. Tell them, let's stay with the issue. Let's deal with the issue. What I said in a videotape on YouTube ain't kill nobody. The tapes you got showing the officer, I got people dead. Let's look at your videotape. See how you stop them, put the, put, put the gun right back on them. I know a white reporter come shoving that junk in my face. What you want? Don't ask me nothing stupid either. So I want to show you the step, pow, step on the ground. Now show it to me now. Time to tell you, cut that fools out. Man, we been made a fool out of I'm telling you, anybody going to be making no fool out of me? Put it, get that back. I don't know who might been on it. I got to shut them down. We got issues. Y'all got me. Amen. We got issues. Hold it. Then you know what bad too? Why we talking about the young people, the young people. We done sat here, man. We done, we done evacuated our elderly. We forgotten about our elderly people. Keep talking about the young people, the young people. This don't just affect one part, but this affect every part of every sex. Amen. Quit sitting around talking about, about the young people. What are we going to do about our elderly people? We done throw them away. They ain't got any help. They afraid of us. We cuss them out and punk them. Rob them and steal from them. Man, we on a global scale. We on a mess. So run out here to my, it's about the young, it's about everybody. I want to live too. 
That's what I'm concerned. I'm concerned about me. Amen. What's going to happen to us when we get older? What's going to happen to them when they get older? So we got to start building today. Come on, son. What's that, the 69th chapter?